Hello. In this video, we have an expression with nested radical. So radical here, radical here, and the radical here. So it is square root, square root 125 minus square root 124. So how to simplify this? The target is to get rid of the nested radical, the radical. So there are two ways to go to get rid of the radicals. Method one. To rewrite 225 as something square and to rewrite 224 as something square. So in this way, we can remove the radical here and then we can remove the radical here. Method two is to convert square root 225 minus square root 224 as something square. In this way, we can remove the outside radical. So so let's try method one, and we say how to factorize 225 and how to rewrite it as something square. So 225 is equal to 5 times 4 over 5. Then it's equal to 5 times 3 times 1, 35. Then it's equal to 5 times 3 times 3 times 45. So here, 3 times 3 is 9, and 9 times 5 is 45, so it can be written as 45 square. So this is what we want. 2025 is 45 square. So, so we have 2025 is equal to something square. Then we need to factorize 2024. So 2024 is equal to 4 times 506 means equal to 4 times 2 times 253. Then it's equal to 4 times 2 times 11 times 23. So look at this. This number cannot be written as something square. So that means 2024 cannot be written as something square. So method 1 doesn't work. So we have to try method 2. So let's focus on square root 225 minus square root 224. So since we know from the factorization of 225, it is 45 square. So square root 2025 can be written as 45. So 45 minus square root 2024. Then we, we know the results of the factorization of 2022. So this can be written as 45 minus square root 4 times 2 times 11 is 22, then times 23. Then it can be written as 45 minus 2. So square root of 4 is 2. So 2 times square root 22 times square root 23. So the target is to, to write this term as something square. So here's the tricky part. We know that uh, 45 is 22 plus 23. Then this is equal to square root 22 square. So this is 22 square root 23 square. This is 23. So 22 plus 23 is equal to 45. And we keep this, this term 2 times square root 22 times square root 23. So, any idea about how to deal with this expression? So, we use the rule a minus b square is equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square. So, a, a square minus 2ab plus b square. So, this can be equal to brackets square root 22 minus square root 23 square. So we have this, we have square root 2025 minus square root 2024 is equal to square root 22 minus square root 23 square. So with this, we can go back to the original equa equation. So that is square root square root 2025 minus square root 2024. It is equal to, so here, 
can be written as this. Then we have square root, square root 22 minus square root 23 squared. Then to remove, to get rid of the radical, so we need to have a positive value and it is equal to square root 23 minus square root 22. So this is the final answer. Thanks for watching. I would appreciate if you subscribe to this uh, channel for more videos. I will see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye.